What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my girlfriends and mine are collectible shelves, which I don't think I've showed you guys yet. And I think it's been almost six months or about last Christmas, something like that, since we actually went and updated and redid our shelves with new stuff. So I'm going to be sharing that with you guys today. Let's get started. So here we go here. You guys probably see the two shelves here from time to time in videos, but I have not showed you guys the whole display. So up first here, we do have my girlfriend's plush, uh, Disney plush. So you guys have Winnie the Pooh, Grinch, and Stitch, which she absolutely loves. And some of her Funkos for Disney as well, which hopefully we are going to be getting a few more in the future. It's just we don't have a lot of room right now. Next up, we do have our office shelf, which has a few Funkos that we were able to pick up. Now, we are planning on getting a display and taking them out of the box and uh, putting them on display. So we are on the hunt for a lot more office Funkos before we do that and update that. But we do have our Dundee Award, our mugs. But there's a couple things in the back that we can't display until we get a few more Funkos and are able to put the shelf together. Next up here is our Scooby-Doo and Ghostbusters shelf. This is a new addition here, uh, something that we didn't have before. So we have my girlfriend's, I think I might have actually bought her all of these, uh, her two Scooby-Doo Funkos, uh, her plush, the Scooby-Doo movies, uh, McDonald's toys, and the Mystery Machine. And over here we do have my Slimer, the Ghostbusters movies, and Mr. Puff. Uh, I think it's a planter, but I'm using it as a like a little display here. So that's one of my favorite new additions to the collection. I absolutely love it. Down here is my Marvel collection, which you guys see that I do have the X-Men video game. I do have some stuff that was here before, but some newer stuff, including some more uh, graphic novels from Kevin Smith and various ones that I have come across. Some new pins, some new displays, some new... Uh, Funkos, and I still have the Infinity Gauntlet right there. That is awesome. Down here is the updates of my Marvel Funkos. There is a few in the back. I have been shuffling the rounds, but the newest additions are the Iron Man Special Edition down here, the Venom, and I think that might be all of the newer ones on here. I do have a few that's in the back, so someday I am going to be having a shelf and displaying them. It's just that's all that I can display right now, and I actually like them in the box like they are. Down here, we do have, it's hard to tell because of bad lighting, but I do have a uh, metal green goblin bottle opener, which is awesome. I do have my Fallout collectibles here, and I do have these here. You guys seen me unbox on the channel, Groots, Drax, and Thanos, which is awesome. Behind all that is all of my movies as well. Coming up here, this is the only hockey shelf that I do have now, so I do have my plush, I do have my uh, Funkos of the hockey players that I did have, I do have my autographed mini stick here, as well as my autographed pucks. Down here is my girlfriend's new friends shelf. If you guys remember before, we had office and friends on the same shelf, so she wanted to expand the friends shelf. And this actually looks amazing. So this is kind of what we want to do with our office shelf. Uh, we want to get more office Funkos and put them on display like this. So that's what our plans are for the office shelf here. I think that would look awesome kind of in this corner. Right next to the friend shelf. I think that'd be awesome. Down here is the uh, Nintendo shelf. So we do have my yoshi and kirby plush that my girlfriend did get me which is awesome we do have our switch games we do have this little uh pokemon uh, pokemon uh pac-man uh plug and play which i love and we have my special edition nes uh sorry special edition game boy advance sp nes which is awesome then we have my playstation 1 and playstation 2 shelf with i do have an addition back there the uh, PlayStation Portable, I do have the Vita, one of my favorite video games, Simpsons Hit and Run, Crash, the controllers are in the back there, my girlfriend did get me the Spyro uh, Funko, and the PlayStation 1, the PlayStation, PlayStation 2 is actually over uh, to be played, and it's actually hooked up to be able to play, but 
that is awesome. Down here is my PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 4 collection. So I have all of my, since I do have less space for my hockey collection, all of my hockey video games in here, all of my PlayStation 3 video games, my PlayStation 4 video games. Um, I did recently pick up Rampage Total Destruction. I just have to get that sticker off of it, and then it's perfect to my collection. And some more Funko Pops in here. And then down here is just the same as before. The only addition is the Andre the Giants uh, figure right there, but everything else is the same. And I do have some overflow of my graphic novels just sitting down here on the shelf because I didn't have much room for them. But the rest is all my wrestling stuff, wrestling books, and uh, DVDs and video games. So that is an update on our collectible shelf because I've yet to share that with you guys. And we absolutely love them. Usually you guys see it's usually my camera is something like this set up and I'm doing various videos, but usually that's all you've seen before is just this. Now you guys have an update of what the whole thing looks like. And whenever we move and get our own place, I'm gonna be showing you guys an update on that in the future as well. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.